Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Fire Pro Wrestling World. This is MWF Miracle on a brand new night. We are on Tuesdays now. So, I hope you guys are liking the new schedule so far. Then again, we haven't got into the show yet. So, how about we get into it now? Uh, we are t sorry, tonight in our m m main event. We do have Noah Colton, cho who chose a tag team partner for tonight to face off against Ryder Prendeville and the MWF champion Ari Scott. And Hannah Keast will go one on one with Lilith Zubin. And we will also have, in a two out of three falls match, Electric Monkey facing it off against Sokolov, formerly known as the Soviet Sensation. But we are about to get into things right now. So let's do this. And tomorrow... On, M on WTF Wednesday, we will have Desi Plays. There we go. There's our social media. You can follow me on Twitter at A13ENT. You can follow De and Desi at Devore underscore Destiny. And on Instagram at GTS Princess. But, before, or sorry, while the superstars are making their way to the ring, please go ahead and smash that like button. And also, go ahead and leave a subscribe. And it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. And we are about to get right into things right now. Let's do this, ladies and gentlemen. As soon as it decides to load. There we go. It's going, it's going. And... Following contest is scheduled for one ball. Introducing first, from Sarnia, Ontario, Turbo! saw Gil and Maximus one-on-one. -on -one. So, we are going to get things going with this match here. Silva trying a Northern Lights, but got caught with a DDT by Daryl. And here we go. There's a oh, roll-up. Break. But, referee Mike Maxwell on top of the action tonight. There's another DDT. That was a good peek on my, so, uh, my social media there. Go ahead and give me a follow One, and a subscription. Two. That would be greatly appreciated. There we go. There's a Northern Lights. One, One two. two. A kick out. We have Gil on the outside as well as Maximus. Those two fought last week. So if you missed that, by all means, go back and watch. Of course, last Sunday, the birthday dash. Give up. Give up. Well, ladies and gentlemen, tomorrow, WTF Give up. Wednesday, it will Give be up. myself and Desi Plays calling the action. So stay tuned for that. And much more. This Thursday, we do have the season premiere of KPW Kickass. There's Give a shoot charter. Give up. I sell that. Give up. Give up. 
Holocaust. That is also known as the Sharp Shooter. But we call it Sheep Shooter here. Because it originated on the Conman channel. We decided to carry it over. Give up. There's a sleeper hold. Give up. Locked in. Give up. And Silva powers out of that one. Mm. Oh, nice job right there. And Daryl is working towards something here, but what's he working towards? Nice drop kick by Daryl. Could that have been it? Silva is signaling here. Another Northern Lights. One, One two, two, three. No. There's a kick. Five minutes gone. There's a roll up, but Daryl kicks out right away. And here comes Silva with that elbow. And there's a headbutt by Silva as well. One, two, three, no, kick out. There's Silva, formerly known as Nate Silva, decided to shorten his name. Okay, it would be easier for people to remember. His stutter followed by an elbow from the top rope. And here we go, there's a back and forth action here. And then Ardell with a super kick delivered. And there's a nice spinning heel kick-ish thing. Anyway. So they're going up. One. Go on there, down with a drop kick to the back of the head. And another one. This time, not on the top of it. And there's an X Factor by Daryl. Daryl is getting absolutely pumped right now. And here we go. Silva with that neck breaker. He calls that One, the twist breaker. Two. two three. No. And there is a kick out. Daryl with a super kick delivered. What's he gonna do here? This drop kick to the back of Silva. And there's a Russian leg sweep. There we go. Oh, tried to close line, but got none of it. And there is a fireman's carry. Oh, another twist breaker. Will Silva be able to capitalize? One, two, two three, no. Another kick out by Ten Daryl. Minutes gone. <laughs> Ten minutes gone in this match. How much more can these guys take? There was a pile driver. He is not going for a pin. Close on. And here comes Daryl. With a hurricane runner! And another super kick delivered! Oh, oh, that was a really low drop kick. This is absolutely insane and absolutely like This man is just getting started to collide in the center. Oh, well, not in the center of the ring, but. In the ring, anyways. There's a code breaker. There we go. Going up. And a code breaker from the top rope. One. Two. And a kick out by Daryl. And another shoot charter. Give up. Will Daryl tap up. out on this one? Give up. And he does not. A twisting neck breaker. Well, of course, not to be confused with the twist breaker. And there 
was that? Close line. And Silver with the first one next week. Like you said, we are Maximus at ringside. Will he become a factor in this game? Or not showing sure. so, victory roll, but nothing. <coughs> Daryl Hurricane Rana again. There's a thing with him. Daryl doing some adjustments there. What has he got planned? Silva says it's over, but no, Daryl counters with that arm drag. No, Daryl, drop kick! Oh, Daryl hits that drop kick, it reminds me of the one Paul London had in WWE. And there's a super kick delivered! Security puts Daryl down. There's a headbutt, but got none of it. Silva ended up hitting the mat hard, ladies and gentlemen. But that still is not throwing him off from hitting that pile driver. Drop kick to the back of Daryl. Oh, man. And, oh! Daryl moved out of the way. There's a splash. One, two, three. We have a winner. Your winner, Daryl. All right, so Daryl picks up the W here tonight. And what a match it has been. We are just getting things started. That was an 86% match rating. And we are going to get things going with the next match here. At the season premiere of MWF Miracle. Contest is scheduled for one ball. Introducing first, Hannah Kingst. And her opponent from Frankfurt, Germany. Loyalist Zubin! Oh, here we go. Last Sunday at Birthday Bash, Jessica Snow successfully defended her 3DW Miracle Championship. She's got a microphone, ladies and gentlemen. I don't give a flying crap about that. I want the championship, and I don't care who I have to step over to get it. I am laying down a challenge for Hallow on October 20th. And then Hannah pops up. Are you forgetting that I'm standing right in front of you, Lilith? You may be the tallest woman in wrestling, but I'm feisty as hell. I will not be underestimated. Let's get this party started. Strong words from both ladies here tonight. And here we go. Oh, oh, what? There's a, a, an elbow to the back of the head of a Hanakist. Hanakist, the one in blue here. Very nice. It's just a happy go lucky. But she says, One, she is feisty as two. hell. Let's see how feisty she can be in this match. And here we go, Hannah. With that body slam. Oh, that comes back with an elbow. Here we go. 
Oh, and Superman, uh, and Superman punched to the corner. Great. Rolls Lilith up. Oh, here comes a half Boston crowd by Lilith Zubin. Give up. Give Zubin up. is the tallest woman in professional wrestling. At about 6 foot 11. Somewhere between six and eight, somewhere between six ten and seven Give feet. Up. Anyways. Give up! Give up! Submission hold there, but well, it's even kicked out of that one. <coughs> so of course, from Germany. And there's a nice body slam there. One. One. And a kick out by Zubin. One, two, not even a two kick out. Five by minutes Nathan gone. Keast. And a keyst former champion. As well as Zubin. And oh, a suplex stunner. Oh, my. Ooh, Give up. Boston crowd this time. Give up. Give up. But Hannah Keast kicks out of that one. Keast throws one Lilla Zubin to the two, outside. Oh, three, three, one to count. Four, four, five, six. Right, and we're back in at the count of six. They could have stayed out there longer if they wanted to, but they want to suplex stunner. And here comes Keast. Springboard hook and one of one, two, two three. No, kick out by Zubin. By Keystone. We tried an ankle lock, but Zubin got it right in the nose of the foot. There's a super kick to Little. A little Zubin. Go Zubin. And there's a big boot to the back of the dome. And that's a good as well. This is an absolute barn burner. Your winner, Loyalith Zubin! Alright, so Lilith Zubin picking up the W here tonight with that Boston Crab. Makes Hannah Keys tap out. But Hannah Keys did get to show her feisty side. So could that be enough to get her somewhere in the near future towards a championship? And we are about to head in to a two out of three falls match, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go. <laughs> Is scheduled for one fall. Or, sorry, scheduled for two out of three falls. Introducing first from the current, the electric monkey. And his opponent from Moscow. The Soviet sensation, Sukolov! Fight! Alright, here we go. Electric Monkey going one on one with Sokolov here tonight. And, oh, this uh, European uppercut to start things off. Sokolov. Trying to come back here. Give up. Former tag team Give partners. Up. Give up. Give up. Brutal battle, including a mask versus mask match, which which Sokolov lost. These two are former best friends and worst enemies. Give up. Sokolov decided to split up. up the team 
of the organization. Shoulder block there by the electric monkey, followed by a huge clothesline. Here we go. Russian warhead. One, two, and a kick out. The winner of this match is the. Where's the first man to score two? Four submissions or one of each. Over his opponent. One, two. And go. Back and forth between the electric monkey and Sokolov. And Sokolov. Ooh, nice spinning heel kick. But monkey came back with that clothesline. Boston Give up! In. Give and up! That is the move that won Give the up. last match. Will it be the move that wins this one? Again, this is two out of three balls. And there are disqualifications in this one. And there goes the Shen Warhead. One, two, two three. three! The winner of the first ball is Sokka. Warhead. We got one fall down. One or two falls to go. And here they go. Second fall Five. is starting now. See between these two here tonight. It's not going to pull the win off. The win off the hit. We will find out. And here we go. There's a scoop slam. Anyway. Yeah, there's a scoop slam there by Electric Monkey. There's a DDT. That's not going to Ladies and gentlemen, this just in. Tactics will not be getting a rematch for the MWF Tag Team Championship. The reason why is because they lost two straight beats to Gil and Daryl. Better known as Sanctuary. There is white noise. Better known as a shock drop. And a Give sleeper up. hold. Give up! Give up! And Soviet sensation Sokolov kicks out. And here comes a Russian warhead. And here we go. One, One two, two, kick out by Electric Monk. So yeah, Tactics will not be doing their rematch. The rematch, or the match for the Tag Team Championship will go to a different team. And there's a super kick delivered! And... DDT! By Sokolov. And there we go, there's a... Oh, oh, oh yes, uh, Back suplex there by... The Soviet Sensation. Electric monkey. Give up. That submission Give hold up. looks like maybe a half Nelson ish type move. But anyway, Sokolov powered out. Five minutes gone. And here comes monkey. There's a nice backbreaker there by the electric monkey. And 
Give up. Another submission hold. Give up. Locked in. I am not Give sure up. what to call that. To Give honest. up. Give up. I don't know. That's really weird one. There's another super kick delivered. Knocked him off the apron. Here. One, two. Electric monkey getting right back in the ring. Another super kick delivered. And, oh, his elbow as well. Here comes Sokolov with that knee drop. <laughs> oh man, electric monkeys. Possibly signaling for the end. Here we go, there's a fisherman One, suplex. One, two, two three. No, kick out. That is what's called a perfect plex. Ooh, small package. One, One two, two, three. three. He pulls out the surprise win here. Here's your winner, the electric monkey. one final fall here tonight. Electric Monkey, Soviet Sensation, they have one win apiece. And here's the deciding Five. fall. That is two out of three falls, ladies and gentlemen. This is the last fall for both. Oh, nice uh, <coughs> no. A scoop scoop two. in. This could very well end the feud, or it could escalate it further. I'm kind of hyping. I'm kind of hoping for both, to be honest. But I can only choose one. So I say possibly end the feud. Seeing how this match is going, I would not be disappointed if it went further. Anyways, Electric Monkey just taking it to Sokolov here tonight. <clears throat> Can he come from behind with a victory is the real question. And, oh, nice clothesline there by Electric Monkey. We do have the Proto-Net champion Elijah Ashburn at ringside. Of course, we did hear Give a up. promo earlier Give up. between Lilith, Zubin, and Hannah Keast. Hannah Keast does not want to be as unrestricted. There's a Russian warhead, ladies and gentlemen. He makes the cover. One, One two, two, and a kick out by Electric Monkey. Okay, so Hannah Keast does not want to be underestimated. <coughs> And Zubin wants a chance at the championship. But ladies and gentlemen, we have an exclusive here. Jessica Snow says that next week on MWF Miracle, before her match, she will reply to Lilith Zubin. And her answer is... Go. There's a, another Give submission up. hold here. Give up. Give up. And what is he gonna do then? Okay, it powers out. So be sensational. Five minutes gone. There you go. Electric monkey. What a backbreaker there. <laughs> there we go. Give another up. submission hold. Give Looks up. Looks like this one could be Give up. by submission here. Give up. Give up. These two each have a fall against each other. There's a super can deliver. And a clothesline. And 
Here we go. Oh, son. One. Elbow outside two. the ring. But Soviet sensation gets back in. Another super kick delivered. And it's ooh, it's an elbow to the chin. Followed by that knee drop. We do have the protoverse in the house tonight. Like this Thursday KPW. Oh, hold on. One, One two. two. Through. No, kick out by Soviet Sensation Sokolov. Anyways, we do have a full house here tonight. And hopefully that'll be the same One, this Thursday. Two, three, kick out. Three, and Electric Monkey three, comes in behind with that small package. Your winner, the Electric Monkey. Alright, Electric Monkey. Pulling off a huge win there. Getting two out of three falls tonight. A hell of a match. Hell of a result. And ladies and gentlemen. James Rook the third has picked a partner. Ari Scott has picked a partner. Ari Scott has told us who his partner is, and that is Ryder Prendeville. <coughs> Noah Colton says, you need to wait until the main event to see who my partner is. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for the main event. Let's see who Noah Colton picked as his partner here tonight. And we're just getting all started here, so let's go. What the hell? Returning from injury. Following contest is a tag team match set for one ball. Introducing first, from England, James Rook the Third. And his opponent, <coughs> from Westbrook, Maine, the Prophet, Noah Colton. First, from London, Ontario, the NWF champion, Henry Scott. And his partner from Chelsea, England, Ryder. Five. All right, rivals starting. Oh no, yeah. no not rivals. Ryder Prendeville starting One. off against Noah Colton here tonight. James Rook the third is back in action, ladies and gentlemen. He is back from injury. And he is okay. And from what? And from what his wife is telling us, that he has waited. Now he's been cleared for a couple of weeks, but he wanted to come back for the season premiere of MWF Miracle. So that is exactly what he did. Bulldog there by Ryder Prendival. And a figure for Leglock. Give up! 
Give up! Well, James Rook the third trying to get involved here. Who gets taken down immediately by Ryder Prendeville? And there's a big double punches to the head by Noah Colton. And there's a no, no, never mind. Ryder's gonna take a jump, and he does now. There comes yeah. a double power bomb by the champion Harry Scott and Ryder Prendeville. Double German suplex, ladies and gentlemen. This guy one, covers one, two. two. And a kick out by James Brook, the one. third. Noah Colton tried to capitalize, but got none of it. Got a one count, that's it. And there's a tag to James Rook, the third. And another double power bomb. James Rook. Rook is back from injury and he is looking great. One, One two, two, and a kick out. Did have a back Give up. injury. Give up! For a while after that, losing that eight. Okay, now that eight pack. Five minutes gone. I'm sorry, that eight pack challenge. He is not allowed to go after a championship. Until, uh, until February. There's a foot oh, set. Give up! Four leg lock. Lock. Give in. up! And he's not going to the championship until February. Because, uh, because the stipulation of the match was to be a losing participant. The one who eats the pin, takes the submission, gets knocked out. Will Fuck. be banned from Fuck. championship matches Fuck. for six months. Fuck. Give up! The Survivor Rumble is Give not up. a championship match. He can be in that one. That is in February. And if he wins that, he will get a guaranteed title match. There's a backpack stunner, also known as Rook one, takes pawn two. two. A kick out by Eric Scott. Anyways, the winner of the Survivor Rumble will go on to either Caged or April Showers to compete for the MWF or KPW Championship. But in a match in February, here tonight though, we have a hell of a match for you. Tag team match player. Scott with the sleeper slam. And Noah Colton in the ring. They will be going one on one at Halloween tonight. They are giving us a preview. With an elbow from the top rope by James Rook. Or, sorry, but not James Rook. Wow. Noah Colton. Go Colton. What's he got planned here? Another arm drop. And... And... There's a power slam. One! One. And a kick out by Ryder Prandeville. Ryder and Prandeville working on each other. Ernie Scott and Mel Colton working on each other. Ten minutes gone. Definitely a match of rivals here tonight. There we go. Nice drop toe hold. Ooh, so, close on the way back. Oh, he's got. This is, of course, the main event of the evening. There's another drop toe hold by Oh, he's got. Tag to Ryder Prendeville. Tag to James Rook the third. Here comes Prendeville Spin Doctor. Also known as the ride of your life. But it was the wrong man. And there's a back suplex there by James Rook III. Here 
comes. Right in front of me. Get knocked down. Oh man. Nice uh, punch right to the chest. There's a DDT. Going up. There's a fist drop from the top. And another fist drop. Come on, to Jerry the King Lawler. There's no one. And a kick out. There's Jerry the King Lawler. That is three of them. That's summer slams. <coughs> there we go. And there's a. Oh, that's a. Uh, Cut rope elbow then. There's a tag to Ari Scott. Tag to Noah Colton. Another crazy. Let's go. There's a lot of your life to James Rook the third. And oh, that's close down there. A super or but a spinning heel kick takes down the profit. Sleeper slam there. Again, the Prophet gets right back up. Here he comes. There's a power bomb. There he is. Got right back up. There's a discus close on One, two. two. A kick out of the fighter. Brandon Four. the third and Noah Colton all right and ladies and gentlemen that it, it was a hell of a match that's gonna do it though thank you for watching please like share and subscribe please follow me on Twitter at a13 ent you can follow a uh, follow Desi plays on Twitter at devore underscore destiny and she can follow her on Instagram at GTS Princess. She will be here tomorrow for WTF Wednesday, so stay tuned for that. As well as KPW Kickass this Thursday, right here at 813 Entertainment. Have a great day, night, whatever it may be for you. And of course, as always, stay frosty.